Hello everybody. This is Rich which the, with the beach chair lock. What I want to do today is I want to go over a little bit on how we utilize the zipper lock as kind of a, a final theft deterrent or level with the beach chair lock. And for those of you who haven't used the beach chair lock before, you don't know much about it. It's essentially a theft deterrent device. Almost like a luggage lock for the beach, for the sports field, for the cruise ship, the resort, things of that sort. And it's a large steel carabiner with a six foot steel cable and a zipper lock. We've got some other videos online that you can check out. And uh, But today what I want to do is I want to show you how to use the zipper lock uh, or the backpack lock, whatever you want to call it. It's basically just a little lock that um, threads in between zippers so that you can secure your bag closed when you're at the beach and you are also using the beach chair lock in tandem with it. You've got it wrapped around your cooler, your beach chair, your umbrella, uh, maybe a pole, maybe a bleacher, maybe a, um, a picnic table, whatever you need in order to kind of deter someone from just easily walking away with your stuff. The final level of security with this is because let's say you've got this utilized, you've got this wrapped around um, uh, a 100 pound or a 50 pound cooler that no one's gonna walk away with or a lounger or an umbrella that's really dug into the sand and makes it difficult for someone to walk away with your bag, you may want to use the, the zipper lock to really secure the bag clothes and be that final level of security. So what I've got here today, I've got a backpack, um, kind of a beachy duffel bag, uh, a beach bag kind of looking purse, and then another big kind of bag that also is slightly beachy. And these are four different examples of bags that you can use because ultimately you want to have either double zippers, which a backpack will usually have. You want to have... Um, a bag that's got like a, a strap loop on the end so you can secure your zipper to it. This one is similar as well. It's got another strap loop. And then this one is the coup de gras right here. You've got a strap loop and double zippers. So I'm gonna go through those real quick and show you guys how to use the zipper lock for the beach chair locking device. Okay, so the first one that we've got is your typical backpack and you've got two zippers here you you compress the lock you put it through the zipper one and two so you've got both zippers together it's secured you've got your beach lock kind of around your cooler and your beach chair you thread the six foot coiled cable in here as well. Oops, I've got that one kind of coming out here. So it's attached and you're not getting into this bag. It's secure, right? Because you've got the two zippers locked together. So in combination with the zipper lock and the beach chair lock and a six foot coil cable, you've got everything put together. So that's one example. Here's another example. I love this bag for the beach. This is a cool little bag. So you take your zipper lock, you've got your bag closed, compress the, the button, open up the lock. You've got a loop here at the end. Utilize that loop. It's another um, security point that makes it difficult for someone to get in your bag. Then you've got a really strong and robust strap loop combined with leather. Boom. You are not getting in that bag unless you're going to cut it. 99% of the people who are going to try and steal your stuff are going to go low key. You've got the element of surprise. They're probably not going to be prepared for this. They're not gonna be sitting there trying to rip up your bag in the middle of a public place. They're gonna try and be discreet. So, you catch them off guard with this, you're pretty much good, all right? Um, if they really have the time and the motivation, could they cut this? Yes, they might cut it. So, you know, the stronger, bag, the stronger the bag, the more theft deterrence you've got. Here's another example. We've got a beachy bag, or kind of like a purse, and this one is very similar. 
in that you've got a very strong strap loop, you've got your, um, your zipper, you thread the zipper lock through the zipper, then you push down, you bring this kind of back up, and that is through there as well. So you cannot open this thing, right? So it's closed, it's secure. That's another example. The final example that I want to show you is this one right here, which is great. Um, and we'll take one of these off of here. Okay, and these things are pretty easy to get off also. This one has double zippers and the strap loop, right? So, compress the button through the loop, through second through second loop, then through the strap loop. Bam, secure. Then you take this, you wrap it around your beach chair and your cooler and or your umbrella or three other bags. You can wrap up all three bags. You might have might need two or three zipper locks, but you can do it. And then you just thread it through here as another kind of layer of security so that they can't walk away with it. So this is now all tethered to all of your stuff. And you can go for a swim. You can go for a dip in the pool. You don't have to keep looking back at your stuff to see if it's there because it's gonna be there. Um, you can throw the football, the Frisbee, you know, whatever you need to do, this gives you a little bit of ability to take a nap, to hang out and have some drinks with your friends and not constantly be looking down at the bags. You can take this with you to the sports field, have your kids lock up their bags with their cleats and their soccer ball so no one takes their stuff. Um, you know, that happened to me when I was a kid, I wish I would've had one of these. So. Um, that's uh, the video for today and uh, just kind of instructions and kind of usefulness for the zipper lock as, as a final uh, theft deterrent device or level for the beach chair lock. Thanks.